48-hour 40, uh, hour shift in the emergency room, I had a moment where I could go take a cat nap in the call room, and this was uh, an answer to prayer uh, during that uh, dream when I was waking up. And so who would have thought that God would answer a prayer with something that's so practical, so um, relevant to our life right now, that was proven later to be validated by Oxford University as 90% effective. How did it happen? So, change your mind? No, I was, I was, uh, yes. Immediately, I had all of this. It was like a download all at once. As I was waking up, um, I knew what to do. I knew why to do it, and um, and I had no one to tell because I was the only one in the call room. And five days later, I had my first patient, uh, Alex, with COVID, and it worked. And they should have died according to everything that was in the news. And we were seeing that everybody was dying if they were overweight, if they had diabetes, if they had asthma. And these patients had both, uh, had all of that, and they lived. And then I saw I had a patient who had two forms of lymphoma on chemotherapy, had radiation a month before, and again, the strategy worked quickly. And then I had another fellow who had stage four prostate cancer, and he's on chemo, and he beat COVID with this uh, protocol but eight months later succumbed to the cancer. And so I have seen overwhelming evidence that, this, that we have effective, outpatient, inexpensive strategies that will help save lives, and I want everyone to have access to that. And that's why I have, I have dropped everything for the last three weeks to totally be immersed with COVID patients in a Regeneron monoclonal antibody infusion center in West Texas where I am – on purpose going into a building for 11 hour days to solely be around people who are infectious with COVID so I can help save their life. And there are other heroes that are on the team with me and I'm honored to work with them. And I appreciate, uh, I appreciate Governor DeSantis. Absolutely. First place. Thank you, Governor DeSantis. I'd love to meet you someday. Uh, thank you, Rand Paul. I'd love to meet you someday and shake your hand. Um, we have some real heroes that have pushed this uh, strategy. Governor Abbott's got a lot better than where he was a year ago. And I and I got to say kudos to Governor Abbott for uh, for pushing this forward with the Texas Division of Emergency Management. So this is uh, kudos to Governor Abbott. He's doing the right thing right now, and I appreciate what you're doing, Governor. And let me just get this and in so before I, we go because you are a hero. I know you don't want that. It's your instinct. It's your spirit. You're doing it. And I've seen this, you know, my dad and other great physicians, and that's what great doctors are. The people really respect doctors and evil corporations and sinister political groups trying to steal your identity and then say, they're the doctor with Fauci up there. But I know that I gave your number out, and hundreds of people called you, and then you put them in contact with people and stuff. And I know that they gave it out. They gave them the same thing. I knew that with everybody else. I know you were working. I mean, I would, like, call you at midnight and you'd call back. So I, we really appreciate you. We love what you've done, and I know – my dad looked like he was dead. He's done like 83% oxygen. We got the thing. Got him. Uh, got the doctors uh, you recommended. Got it all to him within five, six hours. The next morning, he came over there. He's putting together uh, stuff that's come to the house. Again, those, those, those deck chairs. Just amazing. And I saw that, and, I, and I've seen what's happened. And it's just an amazing thing. So thank you so much for spending time with us. Uh, you never put out a website. You're just recommending people that are helping folks. How do people, because you know these interviews are important as well, uh, how do people get in touch with you via email? I know a lot of folks that watch this. If you have other talk shows or other stuff, I'll get you on. I know that's another.